Social media marketing in 2023 might feel overwhelming. I hear that a lot and I feel it as well. There's a lot to choose from, a lot of platforms. But in today's video, we're gonna break down the five most important things for you to focus on to see success in your social media strategy without so much overwhelm or confusion. Twenty twenty three is going to be a very exciting year for social media marketing because there is just so much opportunity and so much new newness going on. Consumers are excited by that. They're looking to consume content in different ways. And I think that presents a really exciting challenge for business owners. The first factor I want business owners to know about for 2023 is discoverability. So the simple answer to how to start being discovered on social media is start creating video content. Video content is being pushed very heavily by the algorithms on pretty much all of the social platforms right now. It's really taken rise over the past couple years. And it's not just being pushed to existing followers, it's actually enabling you to build a true audience. One mistake that I'd recommend avoiding is creating content that is way too niche. Keep it a little bit broader and then you can niche down and take them through your funnel. The second factor to think about in 2023 is short form content. In the past, people have put off creating YouTube channels because it can be very intimidating, but the short form video content is largely created on people's iPhones. Think of that wide appeal, higher level, 101 type content that's really digestible and easy for people to understand. Another key to short form content is to really capture people's attention in those first few seconds. Do something that speaks directly to your target audience and kind of teases the content that you're going to be talking about. Factor three is long form content. Now, just because short form vertical video content is all the rage, that doesn't mean that long form video content is not still important. Relationships are really built with long form content. So don't forget about maybe those YouTube videos or those podcasts or webinar content or even a blog. There are a lot of things that you can do just using a phone, just using a webcam. Start capitalizing on some of these search friendly platforms like YouTube. The one area that that I would caution you about is actually sound. Usually people will forgive mediocre quality video, but they'll quickly click away if you do not have high quality sound. So just invest in a microphone and you'll be good to go. So the fourth factor is repurposing. I know that social media in 2023 feels very overwhelming. When you look at all of the platforms individually, that's a lot of content to create. But what I recommend you do is identify that key platform for you, start there, use that as your main piece of content, and then repurpose to the other content platforms that are available to you. One podcast can become one TikTok, one reel, one LinkedIn post, one tweet, even a blog if you want to transcribe it. Now, with that said, it's not recommended that you simply pull out clips and start posting the exact same thing to every single platform. One, your audience will get bored of that if they follow you on all those platforms, but each platform also has kind of a different style or a different thing that works best there. The fifth factor I wanna talk about is the algorithm. There's a big misconception that the key to social media marketing success is cracking the algorithm. And the truth is you're probably never going to crack the algorithm because it's always changing. But the one thing that doesn't change is email. All of the factors that we mentioned are really just a means to an end to get people down the funnel over to an email list so that you can continue to work with them even if platforms or algorithms change. It doesn't need to be anything fancy. Just send out a quick communication to people to keep them engaged and to remind them that you're there for them. The bottom line when it comes to social media in 2023 is that you have to be creating video content, create video content that is planned out and that actually drives people to that end goal, which in my opinion should be an email list. If you have any questions or anything you'd like to share about your journey or your plans for 2023, be sure to leave them in the comments down below so we can check them out. <laughs>